Nope. <laughs> We're out here at the Sean Doobie Rodeo <laughs> talking with Dean Finnerty. It's a happy crowd here of El Triple D, Golden Eagles, Gage Davis, and Cassie Dunnigan as well. And Dean, we'll start off with you. Really great performance in both slack and short go. You got a feel for the, the Golden Eagles. Oh, yeah, they've done a great job, especially at their home rodeo. They got jobs they're working to keep the rodeo run smoothly. And then, secondly, they're trying to compete and win, and they're really doing a good job on both ends of that. Cassidy was out there in one of the leadoffs out there in go tying in the slack rounds. Uh, Cassidy, how did you feel about your run and, and, and kind of one of the better times there in that first one, really the first time that set the pace? Yeah, I felt pretty good about it. Those goats are a little tougher, so I was glad I could just capitalize on the one that I had and get it done. When you're going, is, is there a difference between going to slack and going to the performances for you, or is it kind of the, does it feel the same either way? It kind of feels the same to me either way. <laughs> I just go with it, only focus on that goat. Dean, when you see someone like her kind of kind of getting into that conversation and, and the women's team really doing well overall, Wacey kind of really found her groove and breakaway. How does that kind of get things going into Saturday for the women's team? Oh, it's fun to watch because, I mean, they just build on it. They build on each other and they get better every day. They do it in practice and it's showing now. So. The men's side of things had a lot of really good performance too. Gage kind of the leader in the clubhouse though for that though. Five seconds flat in his in his steer wrestling run. Nearly got in in, uh, in team roping, but uh, Gage, talk a little bit about the steer wrestling side of things and, and leading into the short go, or leading right now into the second performance. Oh, I'd say it was, felt good. It was a really good run, a really, really good steer anyway. Uh, Bodie had him in the slack. Uh, he kind of knew what he was going to do, so we just uh, kind of, can't come up with a game plan and went out there and did it. You mentioned Bodie. He also had a good time. Cannon had a good time. It, it, steer wrestling's been one of those where you guys have been so close to breaking through in it. it do you feel like this is the rodeo that, that might be that one to, to really put points up? Oh, I think so. Yeah, there's there's a great pen of steers. Uh, obviously, it's our home setup, our home practice pen. We kind of, I don't know, it's just like running another one in practice pen. There's not, no tricks to it. Just go out and do what you need to do. Dean, last one to wrap it up on that side of things is Tate Miller on the on the sat, on the bareback side of things. Got things going as well. One of his best scores of the season. Uh, what's that mean as far as him continuing his good good run? Oh, it's good. That kid's been pretty consistent all the way through. I mean, he was last year too. He was right there on the bubble to make the college finals last year. He stays on task. He'll be there again this year. Should be pretty cool to watch. Looking forward into Saturday. A anyone you're really excited to see out there? I mean, you're obviously excited for your full team, but when you see the success today, anyone that you're, 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 you, you feel like momentum will pick up with them? Every one of them's got that chance to do that. It's going to be fun to see what they get done. Coach, thanks for the time. Gage, Cassidy, thank you as well, and uh, good luck as you guys keep going in the, in the Sean Doobie. Thanks, Caleb. Thanks, Caleb. Kevin.